Sure, so I'm um, Claire McIntyre, I'm the Global VP of Talent Engagement for Diageo and that's our talent acquisition function so I really lead on all of the resourcing and recruitment activity, employer brand and early career. So I've been in that role um, since July 1 this year. Prior to that I was in a role where I was creating the strategy for Diageo. So they've now created the strategy and now I've got to deliver against it, right? What I do believe is we need to have a talent acquisition strategy that's worthy of our brands, that's worthy of our organisation. So that forces me to really make sure that what we're doing is in line with and, and complements and is something that, you know, you can't have this vibrant, innovative company and then have a really old school talent it, it just jars right so there, there very much has to be this um, we have to live our, our brand and live our promise through everything that we do and that means talent acquisition has to kind of really step up and step into that space I would say I've um, challenged it not to be traditional or not to be repetitive or um, I have an, an aversion to hear people say we've always done it that way. I think we need to make sure that we are being very current and understand what's happening externally in social media and market trends, what you guys are doing in LinkedIn, right? We, we, we can't allow ourselves to um, stagnate. We need to be very current and moving with pace. I think the biggest challenge I'm making um, for our function is that, you know, I really want them to be um, proud functional experts real kind of big talent managers that stand in the space and really lead the, the business um, through making brilliant talent decisions, whether it's movement or acquisition. So that's kind of some of the things I'm thinking about. For me, it was about creating a compelling vision that we could anchor in our, per, our performance ambition, the Diageo business strategy. Like, if you don't link it to business strategy, you're never going to get buy-in, right? So it can't. It, nothing that we do can be for the sake of it. It needs to be in support and in service of. So everything needs to link back to delivering that business strategy and that business ambition. Um, so for me, it was really about understanding the numbers and the data. What is the narrative? What's the current reality? Not defending that, but actually creating a, a compelling story and vision that the business could clearly see how what we were doing was going to be supporting that performance ambition delivery. And listen, execution's important, right? So I don't want to spend too long um, having the perfect solution. I want us to be experimental. I want us to try things, but measure the results, prove the results. And we need to be in this space of executing while we're doing this. We can't be in this space of sitting, talking about this perfect, you know, this perfect outcome and asking for resource or asking for people to come on that journey without results.